So I'm uh, excited to introduce the final Android team, Travel Journal. Esra, Richard, and Srivats are going to introduce what they've built for the, uh, over the course of the Android championship. Hi, everybody. Hi, everybody. I'm here with Srivats, Ezra, and I'm Richard, and we're here to tell you about our Travel Journal app. Our Travel Journal app basically has three components. The first one is helping you plan your next vacation. You don't know where to go, you need some inspiration, our Travel Journal app will hopefully give you some. The second part is once you're on your vacation, is to help you get real-time information about that place. It basically to help you supplement your printed bombers and your Lonely Planet, but get that information in real time. And the third component is when you're on your vacation and you're having lots of fun, you want to use this app to photo journal your adventures and share it with the world. So let's go ahead and log in via Facebook and jump right in. So the first thing we see is a bunch of things that happened recently. You can see there's lots of interesting things. Just browse. Oh look, here's a new post. And we're at Lyft. Pretty cool. One of the things that I've always wanted to do is take a trip to Buenos Aires. I've actually never been there, so it's interesting to me. So why don't we plan a trip to Buenos Aires? Well, we can search for Buenos Aires, and we can see what kind of posts are there. And one of the things that I notice is there's some really cool stuff. And they're all by the same person. So let's go ahead and jump into this person's profile. Of course, we can see this person's followers and followees, and so more importantly, we can browse and see where has this person traveled. There's lots of really interesting things. Let's jump in here, this bottom one. I'm an avid photographer, so I think this would be a really cool place to visit to do some photography. We can see what other kind of things are in this area. What else can we do here? Well, I like Jack Pilar. Maybe I'll follow him. Or, you know, maybe I don't want to follow him. Maybe that's for another day. Maybe I'll like this post, or maybe I won't like it. Or maybe I'll make a comment. Let's just say, this is cool. And we'll add a comment. And of course, what else can we do? Well, we can scroll down a little bit, and we can see a map. And we could jump in there, just open up a Google map. And if we want to play around with this, a little bit more is we can open up this little cube. And this is just another playful way to explore some photos. And if you really want to make, be dizzy, you can just stare at this for a little bit and make this go around and around. But if we want to continue our trip, one of the nice things we can do is we can go back out to Jack's profile and say, let's go to the map view. I want to see all the places where Jack has visited. And this map view can really help me take, plan a trip that's just like Jack's. I like the places that he's visited. I want to travel to these places, and this is a perfect tool to help me do so. So after our, I see that Jack is someone that I want to work with to get advice on a trip, why don't I send a message? And we'll just tell him to tell me more. And we'll see if he responds. So let's go back out into the main timeline. And let's jump ahead a little bit. And let's assume that we're tourists now in San Francisco. And what would I want to do in San Francisco? Well, one thing that I want to do, oh wait, look, I think Jack <laughs> had it with me. Oh, he's busy at Cotat. OK, maybe I'll chat with him later to get more information about his trip to Buenos Aires so I can plan my trip. But now we're back here at Cotat. What other things do we want to do here in the city? Well, let's go ahead and open this up. And oh, look, there's a monocle view. Let's see what we can do. We'll have to thank our friends at Wikitude for this trial. And let's see. Oh, look, I can just pan around and I can see a bunch of cool things. 
This looks kind of cool. Let's jump into here. Night at the Palace of Fine Arts. Okay, so maybe tonight we can all head over to the Palace of Fine Arts. Wouldn't that be pretty cool? We can hang out there. We know where it is. And you know, if we get hungry, why don't we go down and just look for some restaurants in the area? And of course, we could look in here. This just opens up a, a Yelp web view. So we could look at some restaurants, but you know, if we all ate a lot tonight. We're not hungry. What else can we do with this? Is Well, I'm on this awesome trip at Lyft. I actually want to share my experiences. And so let's go ahead and take a picture. And let's see what's up here. I see this awesome projection screen. I'm going to share this with everybody because I'm sure everyone's really interested. And I'm just going to say, this is awesome. And after it thinks for a little bit, see what happens. Maybe there's a lot of people here on the Wi-Fi. <laughs> but if it decides to think a little bit too long, maybe we won't be able to see it. But basically, that's the, the last thing you want to do with this app is why we're having a great time is to share your adventures. So again, you can share your adventures with our Travel Journal app. You can use it to help plan your trip. And when you're in the middle of your trip, use it as a reference to see what's going on around right here and right now. Thank you.